when compared to nature fallacy is one fallacy wherein somebody uh, put something out what some other animals in nature do to justify his behavior <laughs> but when you look better to it it is nothing more than an inaccurate excuse for example the lions eat meat so uh, people can also eat meat example or sharks eat meat or dolphins eat meat so it is okay. The problem with that is that you live in a society that you will not mimic anything the lion do other than um, want to eat meat. You don't want to eat your children, most likely. Uh, because lions do that also sometimes and lions sniff on other people's ass if you do that then it is harassment which lions do and dogs do and many other mammals do so it is totally natural that's also um, compared to nature fallacy and it is, it is totally, totally fallible. For example, another example of an, another example of a compared to nature fallacy is saying that since a uh, since a small period of time, because uh, people cut the rainforest of chimps and orangutans, uh, sometimes just find that um, one chimp uh, have adopted our psychopathic tradition of hunting and therefore it is okay to hunt. According to that logic, it is also to rape. It's okay to rape because you can, be, can possibly find some animal how rape. And according to that logic, by the way, <laughs> all human societies have to be not patriarchy, not men structured as leader, but actually one woman structure. Because in chip cultures, often the leader is a female chimp. How do you find that you are filthy man? You're filthy patriarchic. I am have a bigger dick and yeah, therefore I have to control anybody dick suckers. Why well, I have to say um uh, shit all suckers. Stop using arbitrary criteria to defend your position. It is unfair and you don't want that when somebody else used something like that to defend their position to exploit you. If you are not the victim, don't imagine it entirely from your point of view. Because if you are not the victim, it becomes pretty easy to mock your victims, make fun of their entire existence, label your victims stupid, dirty, displaceable and worthless. Like people have all so extremely done around the centuries, even with the each other. Slavery, Nazism, Nazism. Ariaism, colonialism, <sighs> but 
But when you are fixing, things look a lot different from that angle. And there is no excuse anymore for what you do or what your enemy do to you. We vegans are the defenders. If you eat meat, dairy and eggs, you are the oppressor. We are defenders. The animals are the victims. Get a reality check. You cannot be a victimizer and on the same moment be one victim. That's when oxymoron. Stop using double standards. Traditions, beliefs and habits are in no way a justifiable reason for continuing cruelty to innocent living beings who don't want to be victims.